Oh. Fat or jelly in there? Oh. Am I'll I a slow chewer? No, I'm good? just I just inhale. <laughs> Salty chicken plus that maple dorayaki thing tastes really, really good. We're gonna eat lots of chicken. Today. Yeah, we're gonna okay. eat lots of chicken. <laughs> I'm Shelly. And I'm Heidi. And <laughs> And we're from Gaijin Pot. Today, we're back for another round of Kumbini Comparison. Well, Heidi, today we're comparing fried chicken. chicken. We've come full circle of life from our egg video last time. So as you guys can tell, this time we only bought one thing each from each Kumbini because last time, I don't know if I can finish this egg and eat that one as well. <laughs> I'm close to vomiting. We're gonna share it. Sharing is caring. That's right. So now let's talk about pricing. The most expensive being? 7-Eleven at 220 yen. And the cheapest being Family Mart and Daily Yamazaki at 198 yen. So which is the highest in calories? Which one was it again? Lawson. Lawson had the highest calories at 270 calories for one slab of chicken. 7-Eleven is 173. Protein-wise, surprisingly, Daily Yamazaki has 20.7 grams of protein. Family Mart had 12.7 grams. And then for packaging, which do you think is the most eye-catching, Shelly? Eye-catching, I think we can all agree it's Family Mart with the yellow stripes. I agree, it's very festive. Mm. And I feel like out of all of it, you won't see the grease. This one does have plastic though, so oops. So, Heidi. Yes, Shelly. Let's get to eating. So, first is 7 Eleven. I'm gonna hide the scotch tape. Okay. So, there's already a pre rip along here. I guess we just follow that. Oh. Whoa. It looks actually much smaller yeah. than I thought. I'll grab, our, I'll grab our plate and knife. We're gonna be sharing. Oh my Much gosh! Smaller. Wait, I thought there'd be more. Wait, I that's know, it. that's it. Well, I hope it's the best tasting chicken then, just for the price. ASMR. Let's have a look on the inside. Cheers! Cheers. It has good flavor. It's, it's soggy pickery. though. It, we have left it for a bit. I think I would get this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I like the flavor. Peppery, savory, slightly salty. Like we mentioned, I think you should eat it right after you get it at the convenience store and don't let it sit in your bag for two hours. Learn from our mistakes. Just in terms of like hygiene too. That's true. <laughs> So, the 7-Eleven chicken is called Nanachiki. So, each of the kombinis have names for their chickens. Losan is L chicken. Oh, and Fami Chiki is obviously called Fami Chiki. Daily Yamazaki, Mai Chiki. Mini, Mini salt, salt was pretty simple. It was like juicy chicken. Chicken. L Chiki, same deal as 7-Eleven. It kind of has how to open it, which is just simply Rip it. Ripping across. Ripping across. The line. Or ripping from the line. Oh, it looks bigger yeah. already. But I think the shape is much more satisfying. For sure, it's much As a square. Bigger, yeah. Cheers. Cheers. Mmm. You like this one better? It's less peppery. Yeah. This tastes more like KFC. I would agree. That's so yeah. you think? Even if we left it out the same time as 7-Eleven, yeah. there's still crunch in this. This next one, I'm really excited to see how it compares. Because arguably this is the most famous out of all these convenience mm. store chickens. It has something to do with the name, Fami Chiki. Yeah. Everyone knows. Everybody Fami knows Fami Chiki. Mm. And there's like a food hack if you go into Family Mart and then you get their it's like a dorayaki. And then you put the chicken inside. It's salty chicken plus that maple dorayaki thing. Tastes really, really good. Or so I've heard. It's like salty and sweet at the same time. 
family mosh. See, I, I have high hopes for this because it's popular for a reason. All right, the same kind of deal as the last one in 7-Eleven. In the middle, whee! Oh, wow, that's a lot of grease. I didn't know Famichiki was so oily. Oh, sorry. Oh. Ah, cheers. Oh, it's so much softer. Yeah, it's much easier to chew. It's not as chewy as the others, I think. I feel like they, this one uses breast chicken. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And the yeah. other two use thigh. Do you get that feeling? Like yeah. the texture is very breasty. Like very um, flaky mm -hmm. and soft. Are you, are you okay? Yeah. Mmm. So now let's move on to the other two. I haven't Oops. finished. Um, Am I a slow her... chewer? Is no, I'm just, I just inhale, so. <laughs> Let's go to the next one. Yep. Okay, so next we have Daily Yamazaki, which again is one of the cheapest, but has the most protein. Interesting. Oops. You're like a master cutter now. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Cheers. I don't taste anything. It's not much to it. I think because the other ones have been quite full like, of spice yeah, like and full salty, of flavor. Peppery. Compared to them, this one really lacks yeah, flavor. Yeah, it really pales in comparison. Yeah. It's, which is really disappointing because the daily Yamazaki eggs we concluded they're were... They're like our favorite. Yeah, they were so flavorful. But if you're after protein... So maybe if you're bulking... If you can even cut this up and chuck it in a salad, make it yeah, a high yeah, salad... Yeah, that makes sense. No, not high salad. High, high protein, protein salad. salad. And now we're down, and now we're down to our last one of the day. And it's the only one that can stand up by itself. It didn't need to be propped up by something. Anything. <laughs> yeah. Um, it's from Mini Stop. It was the only one that wasn't preheated. Oh, really? Mini Stop was literally just out, out sitting like this. Hopefully, Mini Stop delivers as yeah, flavor. I'm really hoping. Look at all that juice in there. Oh. Very juicy. But this chicken is called Juicy Chicken. Okay, so it does live up to its name. Confirmed. <laughs> Ooh, I'm expecting the juice to come out like Fami Chicky. Mm. Not really. No, no. Not, no juice. There's a layer of fat or jelly in there. Oh, yeah. So they add some padding. Some juicy padding. Or, yeah. Maybe I should put an extra layer of tissue. So oh no, not taking a video. Oh, don't how film unglamorous. This <laughs> Can stop. Cheers. Oh, Last it's one. floppy. It's really Very floppy. floppy. Mm. Very sweet. It definitely has a jelly in it. I taste the jelly. But what for? For the juiciness. I guess when it's hot, the, the jelly melts and makes it taste more juicy. If you heat it up. I'll be back. And I'm back. You can already kind of see the juices oozing out. Oh, <laughs> I jump, it hurts my teeth. <sighs> like it's not very salty or spice or yeah, yeah. spicy or peppery to me. It's definitely it's not very peppery. mild, like a very mild savory flavor. So let's start with our most favorite chickens. Mine was Lawson. Reasons being, it was big. Crunchy and tasted like KFC. Those are all the reasons that you need. Mine was Family Mart. 
I'm not a family mart plant. It's just my honest opinion. And I also like that when you go to the convenience store, you can make a chicken sandwich. I think that's just really inventive. Packaging? Family Mart is the most fun. You know what I realized with the packaging on Family Mart? They have a little section here, memo. So you can actually buy Aww. your family chicken for someone you like or someone you don't like and write them a little message. You know, maybe have someone in the office that always steals your pens and you can get them a family chicken and write, stop stealing my pens, Heidi. Or I hope you have a good day. Maybe a special mention to Lawson? Yeah, special mention to Lawson. I like the packaging actually. Yeah, I like how it's simple. It went the Brown. opposite way of Family Mart. And it was like, we're gonna be cool. We're yeah. gonna be minimal. Yeah, minimalistic. And yeah. Simple, nice. Worst packaging? Um, Probably it's one, one of those. these two, yeah. Uh, they can both get that worst packaging award. Crunchiest, which do you think was the crunchiest? I think Lawson had right. crunch. For leaving them out for a few hours, Lawson still had crunch. So I feel like that means it must have been crunchy. Er, Extra crunchier yeah. to begin crunchier. with. Flavor. I think for us, yeah, it's both a Thai. So yours is Lawson and mine is Family Chicky. The reason why I don't like 7-Eleven is because it's, I feel like the pepperiest. Definitely, very yeah. peppery. But I definitely think if you like pepper, 7-Eleven is your chicken to go for. If you like KFC, Lawson. Awesome. If you like something unique to Japan, Family Mart. If you like no flavor whatsoever, Daily Yamazaki. If you like a mystery slime, slime layer, we don't mean to roast. This is just our opinion. Overview? I like the fried chicken. Yeah. But I don't think I can eat five again. Well, even half of five. Right, that was a lot. For you guys, we'll taste half of all these super high <laughs> calorie, <laughs> cholesterol, high cholesterol. We should do something a bit healthier next time. What if we do salads? Oh. Convenience store salads, because there are. Convenience have everything. We have so many things that we can compare. What do you guys want us to compare next? Please leave us comments because we like reading them. Last time we got told off for not using enough egg puns. And that was our bad. Yeah, it was very... Damn, I'm so bad at puns. It would have been excellent if we used puns. But now we... What's a pun of chicken? Damn, puns are hard. Chicken. Maybe we need someone that can specifically just come up with a bunch of puns. Yeah. What if you guys leave the puns in the comments below? We would love to hear your chicken puns. Yes. Okay, so that's where we're going to leave this video. Thank you guys so much for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. Can we have the um, Wii music? That's my favorite YouTube oh, oh. music. Dun, 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 dun. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> <laughs> I still think we should make like a a song. A song. Can be me comparisons with Shelly and, and Heidi. Heidi. <laughs> <laughs>